Well, it's a crisp morning up here in Minnesota's Leech Lake, central part of the state. We got some pretty cold water temperatures yet. The fish are still pretty shallow. We got a mix of sun and clouds and rain and a little wind today, but it should be some pretty good walleye fishing. Let's go see what one of Minnesota's best walleye fisheries delivers for us today. And the meteorologist here was wrong. And it's supposed to be little showers this morning, and we thought we'd just dodge them, and instead we had to hide the camera and get dumped on for a couple hours. But clearing up, there's a little wind behind that system, and we're set up catching walleyes in one of the shallow points on Leech Lake. There's lots of these. Maybe a northern, but let's find out. Good one to start us out. I could probably just swing him in, but I'll we'll just do that. Grab him, and that's what Leech Lake is famous for right there. Just a good little guy to start us out right there. Right on, we're gonna keep a few to eat today, but I'm gonna bump this guy and might let him go. Let's find out. He's a 19, so in he goes. Another one, man, I didn't even, I broke off spot lock just to start drifting again, cast it out and popped another one. A few boats around in this little corner. It's a, looking like a hot little spring spot for them too. But this is a definitely a numbers lake when it comes to walleye. Another nice walleye, yeah. That a, that a leech lake, boy, I love this lake. Lots of great species to catch, but man, you can see already why it's one of Minnesota's best walleye lakes right there. I mean, another perfect eating size walleye. Two beautiful fillets on there. Keep a couple for a fish fry tonight for sure. We're not sick of eating walleyes yet. Oh, two nice ones. So I'm back here on the Skeeter now, and the reason is the wind's blowing pretty good, and I was standing on that Ultrex pretty good up there to break our speed while we drifted. Instead, I just put the kicker motor down, and I'm just using it to break our speed and get it exactly right. Ideally, I want to be drifting you know, a little less than half a mile an hour. And, and it's a technique called snap jigging where you're just sliding real gently with the current and the waves, bring the jig back to parallel as you go. Yeah, that's a chunker there, man. Wow, what an awesome fish. And because I, I think, because I'm getting my speed more precise with this method of bow control versus using the bow mount, right away, I mean, as soon as I set up and started the drift, biggest walleye of the, Day right there. Really solid, beautiful fish right there, man. That's nice. Beautiful Leech Lake walleye right there. Nice. Unfortunately, Mother Nature's conspiring against us. We got a significant weather system coming in. It's got lightning in it. We're catching fish. We only had a couple hours to get on and bang a few, but we need to get in and be safe. It took us till the next morning to get back out here because there was this weather system coming through right after another. And it looks like the walleyes are still biting. You know, Leech Lake is truly a wind-driven walleye fishery. You've got to fish the points that are exposed to the wind. It's a lot calmer this morning, but we've got a little chop, but the overcast is the key. If it was sunny and calm, the bite can definitely get tougher than it. Oh, nice walleye. We're gonna get it bunched today, so I'm not gonna keep the first one of the morning. Really my favorite rod for a lot of different presentations, but certainly jig fish and walleyes is a six foot 10, uh, medium power, extra fast action. When you're fishing these little swim baits and jigs and you've got that extra fast action tip, it really drives the hook really quickly into the fish when they bite. So a lot of backbone to set the hook into that fish, but enough flex to actually get that hook to penetrate really easily. Almost never miss a bite. Awesome setup for catching walleyes on jigs. There we go. Yeah, just kind of one here, one there as we creep around on this flat and we can release these little guys. There's so many walleyes in Leech Lake. It's just full of all different sizes of, I mean, trophies and meters. And it's just a very healthy fishery. If you love walleye fishing, it's a great lake to go to. Can tell how the bite is starting to get a little tougher, certainly 
way tougher than it was in the wind. When boats are starting to spread out all around the point and not nearly as many fish being caught. It's another nice walleye here though. Probably still in post-spawn mode and they're not eating so much this morning. Another dandy, chunky little leader walleye. Looks like he's gonna get half my shiner. That's a nice one there. Let this fish go. Let me tell you what makes Leech Lake such a great destination for your family and groups of fishermen. Obviously, we're showing you the great fishing here, multi-species. There are a ton of great resorts to choose from up here. A lot of them have marinas. Bring your own boat. There's multiple uh, public accesses where you can launch. Uh, there's an infrastructure in the town of Walker with shops, dining, sporting goods stores. If you need a guide to teach you a little bit about how to catch fish on Leech Lake, there's plenty of guide services available. You can learn more information about Leech Lake if you go to leechlake.org. I'm Roger Cormier. We'll be right back with more Midwest Outdoors.